and we are live here right now in Las Vegas, Nevada. Straight ripping and instinct all locked up at 2-2, two to two, putting on a real good show. And I know the audience is down there enjoying it as they are live and in color and excited just like we are here up in the booth. We are going to go to game five as we get ready for this right now. All right, and it's going to be a Team Slayer game. And as we've said, Instinct's got to win this one, winning two TS games in order to move on. That's not what they're known for, but it's just one game to move on. And if there's going to be any map to do it, it is this one. Team Slayer on Amplified, the fastest game on the circuit. I cannot wait for this one. We are jumping on board with the lead Slayer for straight ripping. He went off in the All-Star game last night. It's sniped down. And Snipedown's opening up with a big double kill, now going off, chasing down Lunchbox, but he's going to be met by Lunchbox's twin brother, Roy, in the base. We're staying on board with Straight Rippin', though, as we jump on board with El Might Warrior. Last time these two teams met up in this game type, it was 50-47, to 47, so Instinct can definitely hold their own here on Amplified. As you mentioned, no power weapons, so it's all about the BR, and we know who's got the dirty, nasty BR on the circuit. It's Roy. He's Famous, all the pros will tell you, he's if not the best, up there with the best. And just like you said, Roy is definitely one of the best. And like you said, Snipe Down has Roy in his top three for the best, baddest BR in the league here. Well, Element Warriors BR is not too shabby either. He's picking up a big kill on Walshie after taking down Roy on the gold side of the map. 12 to 5 straight ripping, starting this one strong. If they're off to a strong start, but again, I, you, you got to remember, this is a, a this is a fight to the end, and I'll say it again, especially on Amplified, when you get to around 30 kills is when you can really start to pay attention. It's like the last three or four minutes of a basketball game. The reason is because you can get a team on a spawn cycle pretty easily. As I say that, they grab three quick kills, but if you get that team on the spawn cycle, you can get four, five, six kills in a hurry. So, again, I'm going to wait. They're off to a good start right now. Doubling them up at 20 to 10, but it's still early. Look at the determination on Legit's face right there, fuck it. And Legit somehow staying alive, picking up the kill on Roy. In the meantime, Snipedown's oh, going to pick up a triple kill. I think they may have woken a sleeping giant. Instinct may be bit off a little bit more than they can chew in this game right now. It looks like Straight Rippin is just playing the game at a different level. Again, it's early, but they've doubled up the score. And you know what, Sundance? I got to be honest. I think Straight Rippin is pissed off. I just asked the crowd, <laughs> who, who did they yeah. want to win, Straight Rippin or Instinct? When I'll tell I said you what. Straight Rippin, not a single applause. They were all going for Instinct, and that is not going to make T-Squared happy. No, look at these guys. You're right. They look pissed off. They're the best team on the circuit, and they're getting no love from this audience. Yeah, Walt She's a superstar, but that was insane. And you know what? Look at this. They are just on fire. Legit is crushing right now. He squares on the face of the bottle for a reason, people. We're jumping on board with him. And one thing I, I didn't see from straight ripping in between this match that I saw from Instinct is Instinct was over there really hyping each other up, getting ready for this game five, and every member of Street Ripping was just focused. It seemed like they knew what they had to do. They didn't even have to talk about it, and they just wanted to come in and execute. No, they're, they, they know the deal right now. It's 33, 34, 22. They've got a, a nice 11 kill cushion right now, but they're not going to let up. What they're going to do is they're going to try and keep Instinct's family. They're going to push, and they're going to rely on their communication and their team shooting. And so far, it's working out. Well, right now, the score is 36 to 25. 30. Straight Rippin now picking up 37 kills. Legit's got 13 of them. Instinct's going to need to make a big push now because Straight Rippin only needs 13 oh, more kills. Legit and Legit with that last just shot. Off. Oh, my God. I think he's feeling better, Pucket, and I think he's a little pissed off by the fact that the crowd showed no love. Well, if Straight Ripping wins this game, you know a lot of this crowd will be cheering for them in the winner's bracket finals. The same thing goes, though, for Instinct. Either team can make it. Instinct needs to make a last-minute push. We've seen it here before on the pro circuit. But it's first, tough, though, on Amplified, Pucket. I don't know. It's tough on Amplified to be down. It, Straight Rippin needs nine kills. All right, it's 41-35. If you're instinct, you need 15. You gotta stop trading kills. But there's not very many places to hide on Amplified. And at this point in the game, 
<laughs> you got Snipe down going to work. Well, He's check not going to let you it's run It's only a five kill game now. Roy just went on a, a huge killing spree. It's 43 to 39. Lunchbox starting to heat things up here for Instinct as well. They're trying to keep this one in. Keep it tight. Walsh is just going to be taken down as well. But Lunchbox is staying alive. Just five kills left here, four straight ripping, but we're gonna stay on board with Lunchbox and the Instinct crew as Lunchbox making another big play, but just three kills left. You Again. gotta check out what T-Squared's doing, and he is gonna yeah. pick up that I 48 kill. Snipedown's gonna pick up 49, and T-Squared going for number 50. No, Walsh is gonna stop him, but T's there, there to clean it up. I'll tell you what, they made a great run at the end, but that's the problem. If you let a team get out to that big of a lead in Amplified, there's just not much you can do. Straight ripping full force. They were just willing to trade kills at the end right there. Made it a little closer with final score. A little closer than that game actually was. But you know what? Both teams, instinct, can't hang their heads. That's an incredible performance. Straight ripping moving on. Great and, job. And you know, you saw T-Squared standing up there making a sigh of relief there. He was <laughs> worried at the end of that game, but congratulations to Straight Ribbon as they advance to the winner's bracket finals. Now Instinct, they're going to the loser's bracket. They're going to have yeah. a tough road ahead of them. Yeah, but you know what? I would not want to be on the bottom there waiting to play Instinct because right now they look like their game's clicking. And their game is clicking. And when we come back, we're going to go down on our main stage trenches with our pro player post-game insider, Nexus.